Hi everyone, welcome back to the my channel. My name is Anil, and in this Laravel video tutorial, we will see that how we can use the pagination. So this is the my database table, and here you can see that some data, and we will use the pagination on this data on our Laravel. So these are the steps of the video. So we will do some database configuration in .env file. We have to make controller, router, and view, and after that we will add the uh, pagination code, and at the last we will add some style code also so that it can look some better way so first of all let's open dot env file and here you have to add the three things one is your database name username and the password so that you can connect it and after that uh, you just have to restart your php partition right and after doing this your laravel can understand that which database i have to catch from the php mysql so my database name is youtube here you can see that and my table name is uh, users so now i am just going to make a controller so just write here php artisan make controller and controller name can be like a profile and just hit the enter after making this just open the web.php file and just make a route for it and just uh, put the route name list and now just give the profile your controller name and we will make a function inside it with the name of index all right now after doing this let's open the uh, profile controller and first of all just import the database class here so just use illuminate support facet and just use the db now let's make function with the name of index because we define the index function in the web.php file for routing so just return here db double colon table and table name my table name is users i just show you at the early time in the video and let's try to catch the data so here let's uh, just catch the list url and here okay mm -mm, let me check what's the issue here yep i actually have to put a colon comma here not the dot now you can see that we got the data so this is the json format now pass this data to the view so for that i need a view and in the resource file let's make a file with the name of users list or you can just make it simply users dot blade dot php and just make h1 tag and here you can just write here user list it should be users list perfect now let's take this data in a variable and just return here your view which we just made here with the name of users and in the second parameter use an array and pass this data as an key and value pair to our data perfect after doing this you are able to get the data here and now just use a table here and let's close the table and inside this table let's take some uh, tr and td so let's take tr and td right now make okay so let's close the tr first and now let's make td all right and here i need a for each loop so just use for each and dollar data without no space data as dollar item perfect and let's close this loop here like uh, at the rate and for each perfect and inside the trtd just write here dollar item and use the uh, name all right because we have a uh, four columns name email and is and we will show the name email and is here all right so just refresh here now you can see that we got a list but this is a single list all right 
so we can just uh, add two more columns here with the name of email and age now let's see this is looking fine but uh, I'm just going to add uh, some lines of code so that it will look a little bit more better so in the style just use this one and now let's see now the list is looking better okay so listing is fine here so now it's time to add the pagination for the pagination you just have to make a very small change here just use here paginate all right and you just put some uh, pagination number like I just want to show a five result on a single page and after here you just have to use dollar data and links function now let's see okay okay so I just misspell the links yeah now you can see that we have five result on a single page and we have a pagination also so I'm just going to click on a second page and whenever I'm just click click on a third page only one result is here because we only have a uh, 11 results in our table right so you can just modify it also if you just put here 20 then there will be no pagination at the bottom because uh, yeah because uh, we don't have any data uh, more than 11 that's why there is no pagination if I just put here 10 then there will be two paginate on a one page there is a 10 data and on the next page there is only one data alright so if I am just going to put here two result per, per page then you will find here lots of pagination like this right so thanks for watching this video this is all about the pagination if you still have any kind of confusion you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel and like this video bye bye take care